just talk a little bit about the history of credit bureaus in Nigeria. So the, essentially the father of credit bureaus in Nigeria had an opportunity when he was an immigrant in the United States to get credit. And what happens, he was a student in school. Uh, he received a $500 credit card from Chase. And he was really amazed at why would a bank give him credit? And he's an immigrant to that country. And he knew that his father and many of his family friends, they saved for everything to get, um, to, to buy whatever they wanted. And so with that information, he was wondering what makes it possible for a bank to be able to have the confidence to give someone credit? Because in Nigeria, it just wasn't something that was very easy to get access to. And so with that in mind, um, he, we started a company to be able to say, let us be able to help banks have confidence to give access to credit to everyone who needed it. And with that, in 2003, Nigeria's first private credit bureau was established. Uh, what it does is it works with all of the banks and other service providers to be able to gather information about anyone that they have given credit to before. That information will include everything from how you perform with the credit, how much credit you've been given. If you have not performed with the credit, that would also be shared. And so what it does, it allows for everybody that is on that credit bureau to build what you say a good reputation when it comes to credit. Um, that reputation would allow for you to continue to grow and get more and more access to credit. So with the idea of being able to give banks confidence to give money, in Nigeria we've been able to see that that exists uh, with, the, like, with the establishment of a credit bureau.